Let's multiply seven times one half. And here's how you could do that. First, you could just add one half together seven times. That would give you the answer for seven times one half. Maybe an easier way would be to take seven and think of it as seven over one. Seven divided by one, that's still seven, but now we have this fraction here. And we can multiply that times one half. So when we multiply fractions, we multiply the numerators, then the denominators. Seven times one equals seven. One times two, that equals two. So in answer to our question, seven times one half, that gives us seven halves, or seven over two. This is an improper fraction. Seven is larger than two. So let's change this to a mixed number. Two goes into seven three times. So three times two, that gives us six, and we have one left over. Bring the two across. And seven over two equals three and one half. So that's it. Seven times one half equals the fraction seven halves, or if you want a mixed number, three and one half. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.